Alright, hey guys. Today I wanted to make a video about the, um, a review on the Droid Lucid. It's more of an outdated phone. I mean, it's, it's, um, I think it's one of the only phones that, um, at least for Verizon, I am on Verizon, um, at least I don't see many droids that are made by LG, um, in the Verizon store. And, um, and it's more outdated, um, my, my mom got it, um, on the, I'm trying to think, 8th of June of 2012. And then we got crappy little phones and we switched to smartphones in July. I got the Samsung Galaxy S1 Stratosphere, and at the time it was a really good phone. And then, you know, you can't even buy a case for it for over 10 bucks. Anyways, and I think they're not like 97 cents or something at Radio Shack, but I'm not really sure. And then um, recently I lost that phone. It fell right out of my pocket. And my mom um, loved her old phone, which was my new phone when I first got my phone. And then um, and she hated this phone. I don't know. She doesn't. I don't know what she was thinking with getting this phone because she doesn't even know how to answer calls on this thing. So she did. She and I decided to trade and. Um, so, um, and I know you guys want me to stop talking about random junk that you don't want to hear, and so let's. Well, first before we turn it on, let's look at the body. Um, it's quite nice. Um, yeah, this is the back of it. I always like the looks of the backs of the phone for some reason. Hang on, to get better lighting, I'm gonna turn this light off. I know you guys can't see anything. I got my thousand lumen Cree flashlight. And you can see that man. You can see that's kinda red. It's got like kinda reddish, purplish. Actually you know what? I'm just gonna turn the I don't know how this is gonna work. And as you can see how it's kinda reddish, purplish. It's quite dirty back there, but um uh, um, like any droid nowadays, it's 4G LTE, and yeah, and you can see the big LG on it, and the very bright flash in the camera, which it records in full HD. Here's this side of it, which that's just like, just a little add-on, yeah, yeah, it's just like a little add-on to kind of look like the power button, and it looks basically the same. The um power, the volume buttons are right here, which it does not turn the on the phone if you push them. There's little, there's a little charging a uh, charger thing, and um, on the bottom there's really nothing. And here, with that same side, on this side there's nothing except for the power button, and on the back right here's the speaker. Hang on, there you go. And if you take, there's a little cut in there so you can take a back. Now, here's my 4G LTE SIM card, which um, um, I'm going to try to cover up because there's some numbers on it that I don't want you guys to see. Um, let's see, do I have anything I don't want you guys to see? Not really, actually. Um, yeah, battery in it. I think I'm going to take it out because there may be something confidential on my phone that I don't want you guys to see. Um... Yes. Yeah, the battery, I just don't really like it. I really don't like it. It it dies, but it, it charges in about an hour from 4% to 100%. It charged in less than an hour, but it dies very quickly, and there's really a, it barely any pro things running on it. So, yeah, and it's very big, heavy, and um, it gets really hot. And unlike the iPhone, it's got a little micro SD card slot, which is why I got an Android. Well, to start, I got an Android because I knew iPhones do not have a, a micro SD card slot. At the time, our dad did not want to get the 4S, iPhone 4S, and only the 4. My brother got the 4, only 3G. I didn't want it. I wanted 4G LTE. In the front, it says LG and Verizon. Now, if you power on the phone, hang on. Oh, I I took out the battery. I I guess you guys get to see it power on. It vibrates a little bit. LG. It's gonna take a few seconds. Yeah, 
Here we go. That's the, just the Verizon jingle thing. There's Verizon right there, as you can see. 4G LTE. And what I like about this phone, unlike my other phone, is sometimes my other phone, one time I had to wait 15 minutes for it to power on. It was just doing that. And anyways, let's see what we could talk about in the meantime. Oh wait, it's done. And this is going to be a very long, um... Um, it's going to be a very long review. And, um, um, as you can see, it's got the little password thing. That's just my really generic, very, very generic, um, password. Um, what I like about the, the droid is that you could, it's, um, well, it, right now it's booting up, still booting up, but usually it's really um smooth and it um you could choose um if you hit the um settings button hang on let me get out of that if you hit the settings button go to um home screen settings um screen swipe effect and you could choose any of them like all of these personally I like layer but let's do domino see actually I may want to keep that I'm not entirely sure um I'm not gonna go through all of them but see accordion that's really cool you can kind of see something in it but of course you guys all know with the TX10 how good it focuses on the um on screens um every page is going to have a google search on it um this is the droid sense anal um not no digital clock um it um currently my um, battery temperature is 80.6 degrees, and I just powered it on. Um, let's see here. Play Store, browser, camera. Ooh, let's go camera. I'll show. It's. I don't know if I said, but yeah, it records in full HD. Tap to focus with um. And let me turn off the flash. Yeah. Um. So yeah, do you want to see what a video looks like? apparently my phone will not connect to the computer therefore I'm not able to show you the video I'm sorry to everybody who really wanted to see that video but it just can't happen now back to me talking about the phone did you guys like it I hope you did um let's go back and um it's quite a, um, some things on it are quite rip-offs of the, um, of, um, iPhones. Um, like if I hit search. Um, let's see here. Um, let's see here. If I were to just do, um, like, um, wait, hang on. I'm trying to sw get to the new keyboard. Um, um, my brother kept yeah saying, "Oh, that's just a ripoff of Apple," because the keyboard click sounded exactly like um, Apple's. So you know, um, and like um, from the point of when I turned it on to now, it's dry. Um, drained four percent, and nothing is on. As you can see, nothing is on. And let's see here. I have Bass Fishing 3D on the boat, Office Jerk, Taki Ben, B11.5, which is a radio station here in Fredericksburg, Police Scanner, Fast Burst Camera Light, Fart Droid, which I play during class, Skype, Talking Tom 2, Waze, The Weather Channel, Where's My Droid, Register, um, which is Square, um, Shop Savvy, Flashlight, Facebook, Temple Run, Alarm Clock, Groupon, Calculator, Rich Note, Gallery, Flashlight notif notifier, which works. Funny sounds, strobe light, funny sounds, maps, sensor beep, antivirus, mobile hotspot. I, I don't want to go there. What's wrong with this thing? Okay, now let's see what the flashlight looks like. I'm going to turn out the light. Wait, no, I do not want to. I hate. What? Ow. 
Hang on, why? Why is that flashlight not turning? Hang on. Technical difficulties. There we go. It's quite a bright flashlight. Like I said, I don't know if I did. You can see it in there? The brightness of the flashlight. And the camera lens. Yeah, it's quite a bright flashlight if you need just any flashlight. If you just need a flashlight and you have your phone. But it's no match to the Cree 1000 lumen flashlight. But of course, this isn't the 1000 lumens. And, um... Actually, I may want to keep... I actually want to keep the light off because it'll be better to see the screen. Now let's see here. Um, it's got um one problem I have with the um any Android phone is that um the apps um pages are already there and once you I think once you um have enough of them like put um all apps on here once you fill it up there's no more room. So yeah, I could, um I'm gonna start creating folders. Um, but this thing only came with um eight gigabytes total and I added an eight gigabyte micro SD card. Now um, it's got application, music play, actually let me come closer, applications, music play, contacts, messaging, phone. I don't want to go here, I may go there, I don't want to go there because um, I don't think there's any music on there. Um, contacts, um, because there's private um, contacts on there. Um, messaging, same reason, phone, same reason. Actually. No, I don't want to get music played because I think there's a few songs on there, but I will get copy copyright strikes. But, um, I will go to where is it? Where is it? Funny sounds so you can hear the sounds. Let's see here. Um, oh yeah, here we go. Austin Powers. Good movies. Um, so, um, if you do not like Austin Powers, I will play Horny and you will be able to to hear the sound of, uh, that this phone makes. If you do not like Austin Powers or you think that this may be offensive to me, I mean to you, don't listen to it. Three, two, one. Do I make you horny, baby? And that's all I'll do. Anyways, so and stro uh, strobe lights, um, strobe light. I will give you three seconds to exit this before you, um, before I actually, um start the strobe light because um if you have seizures or epilepsy or whatever it is do not watch this three two one see well that's a separate app for it but you know i don't know why i did that um the backgrounds on this thing sorry about that backgrounds on this thing are quite nice um let me go there um home screen settings Wallpaper, um, wallpapers. That's polar bears. Red stuff. The desert. I don't even know what that is. Lights. Um, more lights. Water. A telescope, which I currently have, and that is it. Um, wallpaper, by the way, and are and there's charging wallpapers, which I really like, which I have it on Rising Tide, because that is the, um, most I can understand out of it. But anyways, oh, by the way, it's got themes. I'll show you those themes, I think. Yeah. Um, those are basically the themes I have it on Optimus. Um, yeah. So, um, any questions? Um comments or anything like that you could um place in the comment section um i will probably do a follow up to this um if i get a few more questions yeah so that's the phone itself and that is it epilogue um if you guys were wondering why I had the square app, this is why. The square. It's small and dirty. But yeah, quite nice. You need to enter.
your social security number in order to use it, which I will not do. Plugs directly into your headphones jack right here. And there you go. You cannot play sounds with this if it's plugged in, obviously. And that is it.